Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Sam and I would love to have you guys subscribe so you won't miss out on any new videos. So today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my Valentine's Day Fragrance Mist video or Fragrance Mist to wear on Valentine's Day since it is approaching. Whether you are celebrating with your friends, your family, your significant other, or by yourself, I think it's super fun to kind of like, I don't know, just feel good on Valentine's Day. I know that like I'm super excited for Valentine's Day, so without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So the first mist I have to share with you guys is Pink Velvet Cupcake. So here is what she looks like in all her glory. This one is in the actual like fauceted collection. I feel like the fauceted collection is cute, but they're kind of like doing everything in the fauceted collection, so I feel like it's getting kind of like mundane and boring. However, this scent is perfect for Valentine's Day. I mean, it's pink, and that's what I think of when I think of Valentine's Day. So, this has sparkling red berries, whipped vanilla or whipped pink marshmallow and sugared praline. People say that this is kind of like um I think it's called red, like red velvet sugar or something like that. It reminds them of a more like wearable version of this. This scent, it just smells like such a girly fragrance. Like it's sweet, like candy, but there's a fresh aspect to it. And I think it's those red berries that really just kind of like liven this fragrance up. It's not super sweet. It's nothing like a pink sugar, which I think also would be a very good fragrance to pair with this mist. This is perfect for just like a casual, you know, brunch moment or maybe a breakfast date or just kind of like ordering in. This is amazing for it. I don't know. It smells super sweet and girly and I can just imagine like someone who's super, super girly wearing this one. Another more like chill date night kind of fragrance mist I have is this one that I just recently picked up. This is Body Ecology with Vanilla. So here's what she looks like. I think this packaging is honestly really, really cute. So this has, um, it says sweeten your day with creamy scent of whipped vanilla. So it says it has creamy florals and warm vanilla. It kind of reminds me of fresh vanilla from Pink that they released last year. I think this is great for honestly anything if you're chilling at home or maybe you're going out for dinner I think this is perfect or if you're doing like a movie like a movie date this would be really good it's like a very nice like wearable but not too sweet vanilla vanilla is something that a lot of guys love the smell of and women so I think this is perfect this is definitely nothing like super fancy though this is definitely more chill relaxed maybe you're just going to like a cute little restaurant but definitely nothing like ooh, you're going somewhere fancy fancy but yeah this is the next one I have next up is one that is new to me but I love so much this is perfect for Valentine's Day this is pure wonder you guys have seen pure wonder I feel like this is like another iconic fragrance from Bath and Body Works I didn't include you're the one or into the night because I've included those so much before but this is definitely great for a more fancier occasion if maybe you guys are going to like a really nice restaurant or a nice brunch place I think this is great so this has iced rosé star jasmine and warm white amber this one smells like a little more powdery and floral but it definitely smells like Chanel it smells very expensive it's nothing like very childlike or anything it's definitely more like womanly and feminine something about this fragrance just makes me want to like do a double take like i just want to keep smelling it and i think this would genuinely attract so many people i've already gotten so 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 many compliments when i wear cure wonder it's not like a super long lasting mist but i still think it's great for valentine's day because like Typically, you're only out for like a couple hours, at least I am, and I think this is cute with like a little mini skirt or like a pink top and like a cute little crop top. This would be so cute or even like a dress or something fancy. Whatever you want to wear, I think this is cute, but I wouldn't really wear this for like, you know, sweatpants and just make it a homemade pizza kind of vibe, you know? Another more relaxed fragrance mist that I think is perfect for Valentine's Day is this one. This is Joy Sugared Snickerdoodle by Bath & Body Works. This was released in like the more holiday season, but this has notes of snickerdoodle spice, creamy vanilla, and sugared musk. This is one of my all-time 
favorite fragrance mist as of lately. It just smells so edible and delicious. And if maybe your partner or someone, whoever you're with, really loves like sweet gourmand scents, this is the perfect one to wear. They are going to be like cuddling you and kissing you and freaking holding on to you all night long. I think it's perfect for that kind of like yummy, sweet scent. And this is definitely something I would like bake brownies in or like me and my boyfriend just made brownies yesterday together and I think that would be a great date night fragrance. I mean again Valentine's Day isn't always like dressing up to the nine and you know going to a super crazy fancy restaurant or doing all these things. Um, I genuinely prefer to kind of stay home and watch movies and make cakes or cupcakes and you know chill so this is definitely probably what I will be wearing on Valentine's Day because I hate going out on Valentine's Day because it's such a long wait at restaurants but yeah this is super super edible by far one of my favorite myths right now really quickly I kind of just want to switch it up and I want to talk about a perfume this is Zara Gardenia so here is what she looks like this is a Zara perfume and I love this perfume so freaking much I just think it smells so expensive this is like a dupe for YSL black opium I swear it smells exactly like it it has that same like coffee note to it again I think this is great for a more formal dinner I don't know like you're wearing a black dress this is what it gives me it's giving me very professional classy vibes I don't know exactly what the notes are in here, but this is super, super inexpensive. You can get this at Zara while you're picking up your Valentine's Day outfit if you want. I know that like maybe if this is like your first Valentine's Day with your partner, this would be something I would definitely wear because, you know, it's a little more exciting. It's a little more fun. You're trying to impress. I think this is amazing. And another new fragrance of mine that I have is Fairy Tale. I mean, the packaging alone just looks perfect for Valentine's Day. This has pomegranate nectar, fresh orange blossom, vanilla bean, and warm amber. I feel like it has all of those amazing fragrances. You have the vanilla bean, you have the amber to add a little more depth to it. This is definitely something I would wear. I don't know, where would I wear this to? I'm imagining all the Valentine's Day festivities. I would say like going on a boat. I don't know why. Like maybe if you're going on a boat right at night or like Definitely something at night, like a night activity, like you're outside doing something because like it's very like, you know, forced vibes. I think it's super cute. Again, you can wear this with anything. I think like some black skinny jeans with some cute heels. This would be an amazing look. But I don't know. I don't know if I would wear this like chilling at home just because I don't know if that's really the vibe I get from this fragrance. Again, you can do whatever you would like to, but personally, I don't know if I would, if I would wear this just for like chilling at home vibes. I think this is definitely more like we're going out somewhere. Nothing too crazy, but like we're going out somewhere. You get me? And next fragrance is Frosted Coconut Snowball. I got this during the semi-annual sale. This has Frosted Coconut North Pole Vanilla, Winter Freesia, Sunkissed Woods, and Spun Sugar. So when you like hear of this fragrance, don't think of it as a very tropical kind of coconut scent. It's very much like a winter coconut. There's something more creamy about it. It's not like super fruity coconut. And it is just so like cozy and warm. Like this is something that I feel like if I were a guy like I would just want to like hug whoever is wearing this because it just gives me like warm cozy vibes like comforting like that's kind of the vibe I'm getting and this I would wear like to bed I think it would smell amazing like just to wear to bed when you're you know if you're sleeping over whatever it is I think this is perfect and again you can wear this I could honestly feel like I could wear this like going out somewhere too like if we're going out somewhere and it's cold outside if you live somewhere where it's super super cold this would be a great date night fragrance I'm so excited I need to wear this more because I love it so so much and the packaging so freaking cute I'm obsessed last but not least we have a thousand wishes 
for you and I picked this just because it's red and look at how adorable this packaging is. I debated on keeping this because it does smell kind of similar to Forever Red to me. This has a celebratory blend of pomegranate prosecco, sweet elderberries, star jasmine, and sugared woods. But it smells a little different. It smells a little more tangy than Forever Red to me. Again, this is something I would wear wearing like a red dress. Like you are making a statement. You have a red lip on, you have a red dress. Like definitely something you're trying to like step out and be like, wow, who is that girl? That is the kind of fragrance I feel like this mist is. Like you are, you're that girl. Like all eyes are on you. You don't mind the attention. I think this is amazing. I I don't know. I don't know which one I'm going to wear. Like, this is so hard because I feel like I love choosing my fragrance mist on, like, special occasions like Valentine's Day, New Year's Eve, you know, Christmas. Because, like, it gives you a reason to dress up. So, yeah. I'm super excited. But this is the last fragrance mist. Alright you guys, so that is the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all of my favorite Valentine's Day fragrance mist and fragrance mist that I will be choosing from. Let me know if you have one that I showed in this video that you're going to wear or if you have one that I didn't show. I would love to know because who knows, maybe I'm forgetting about one, but... Yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below and follow me on TikTok and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!